A lot of people think that within the next 40 or 50 years, China will be the dominant power in the world. I think there is at least one good reason why that may not be the case, and that reason is pollution. In places like Beijing and Shanghai and Shenzhen, where 50% of the world's electronics are manufactured, air pollution has gotten so bad that it's a major cause of death among the Chinese people. Even if China were to undertake a crash program to improve this, it would take many years to make a difference, and by that time, even more damage would have been done. The effect of this is basically to decapitate the technocratic class. These are all the people who keep that system working. And it's not just the air. The water is also filthy in many places. I've heard that as much as 50% of the water in China is not fit to drink. There is already a diaspora of young, highly trained people leaving China, and I'm sure that in part this is due to living with air that is not fit to be taken in, water that's not fit to drink, and food that's not fit to eat. So this is going to lead to further problems in keeping the supply chains going. The upshot of this is that if you are an American manufacturer or a so-called American manufacturer who is getting most of their goods produced in China, you are at risk. If you are in the position of being a hostage to Chinese manufacturing, it's high time that you start at least building some pilot plants in the U.S. so that we can once again learn to produce what we use.